Hello everybody, I uh, just wanted to share really quick what's going on with the Free the Zombies world. Um, so I thought I'd make a quick post about it. Um, right now we um, are focused on a few things, uh, mainly um, developing art for band logo and merchandise. So we have a graphic uh, design artist on board with us to work with us. So uh, we're hoping to have March out uh, merch out by March by the end of March and also hope that by the end of March we can release two songs um, and that would be uh, two songs that we're currently working on right now in the studio one of them is called if I decide to fall the other is uh, conscience so hopefully those songs will be fully recorded mixed mastered uh, and able to release soon by the end of March. Also wanted to um, do a quick, um, like a tip for anybody that's interested in uh, buying instruments. Uh, I just recently purchased two guitars and it was through online bidding and at the risk of giving away my secret but, you know, with 28 subscribers, I'm not too worried. So that's why I'm sharing this now. Otherwise, I totally keep this to myself. It's a great little secret. And that is shopgoodwill.com. Uh, besides clothes, jewelry, and other household items, they also have musical instruments up for bidding. And um, I'm going to show you the two guitars that I bid on and one because i'm excited about this i hope uh these guitars are you know quality and that they play nice so that's the only thing about buying online is you're not sure what it sounds like what it plays like so there's a lot of gambling involved but you know uh the price kind of makes it worth it um so let's see here we have This is a Epiphone made Les Paul. I believe I believe it comes with a gig bag, which is also a plus. And um, I think after all the bidding and shipping and handling and everything, I, I'm paying 236 for this guitar. So that's not bad. Uh, these guitars usually run for three, 350, maybe more brand new or even used actually. Uh, br brand new, they're even more. I think like five, six hundred, seven hundred dollars used. You can find them in the three, four hundred dollar region. So I'm getting a deal. And again, it's kind of a gamble. Hopefully it works out. Uh, the other guitar I'm excited to play and see how it sounds is this Ar Oscar Schmidt Delta King uh, Washburn. It says Washburn, but I'm not sure Washburn belongs in the name. I think that might be a misname. Oh, it is by Washburn. Actually, it is by Washburn. So similar thing. It's you know it's not that the it's not Washburn. It's not Gibson. That are making these guitars but it's these other companies by the under the umbrella of those companies so you can expect some quality there um and it's this is what it looks like so i'm pretty stoked it's beautiful looking guitar it's got that um semi-hollow uh, body so there's definitely going to be a different sound than the uh, Stratocaster I've been using so far, which I'm very happy with. But, you know, there's certainly some tones and some bite that I'm looking for that I'm not getting out of the tel uh, Stratocaster right now. So um, after shipping and handling, this guitar cost me, you know, after the bidding, uh, I was able to win the bid with $100. $93 total with shipping and handling. So I feel like that's a good deal. These guitars also go for, you know, $300, $400 brand new. I've seen them used for, you know, uh, $250, $300, $400, $500, $600, $700, $800, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000,
Uh, actually, Brent, yeah, so I think I'm getting a good deal. Hopefully it pays, plays well and there's no hidden damage or anything like that that you couldn't see in the pictures. But to anybody that's looking to uh, try and buy an instrument on the cheap, uh, check out Shop Goodwill and uh, hopefully I'm not flooding the market with this post. But that's just my little tip. <clears throat> And uh, again, thanks for tuning in. Um, stay tuned for the release of our songs and merch. And um, have a great one.